So James, after coming in from Oxford in the, in the summer, you had an impressive season last season. How important is it for you to hit the ground running in pre-season going into the new campaign? Yeah, I think it's important, not only for me, but for, for anyone, for any footballer, it's important to, to go to go head first into a season and to, to start as quickly as you can. You know, especially as a forward player, you know, the quicker the forward players start the season, you know, the more points, the more goals, etc. And, you know, as a team, we, we want to and we're expected to make a fast start to the season. So, yeah, it's incredibly important to... For, for personally me to, to build the momentum of last season, but it's also important uh, for the team as well. You're one of many fresh faces to come in. What's it been like, Jenna, with all of that? Yeah, it's been spot on. Um, you know, as the gaffer said in his, in his interview, after Saturday we've got a bit of a bonding session, you know, after the restaurant, coming back here, you know, and, and that's important. You know, the training's been good, there's been a lot of banter flying around. Um, you know, little things help. You know, little things like being together in the change room, you know, that sort of thing. And, and, and when you get into the season, that's really important. And um, obviously that comes with winning games as well. And, you know, we picked up a win, albeit not the most important one, you know, in a pre-season friendly on Saturday. But the more you win, the more you gel as a team together. Do you think that camaraderie can push you over the line sometimes in a game? Yeah, definitely. I've never been part of a successful team that hasn't been a really close dressing room. You know, it's important for, for the entire dressing room to be supportive of one another those that are playing, those that might be on the bench, those that might be out of the squad, you know, because things chop and change in football and everyone needs to be ready to, to come in and play their part. And that sort of camaraderie, that togetherness really, really affects that. And going into Totten on Saturday, how important do you think a win would be, you know, for momentum to get confidence up going into the campaign? I think winning games becomes a habit, the same as losing games becomes a habit. So, so yeah, winning is important. But, but as you'll hear in the gaffers interview as well, of course, it, he said that, that it's looking to get those those, those patterns of play, those things going into the season for the game that, that is of, obviously the, of most importance, which is well in next week. So yeah, a win is obviously wanted, no footballer ever wants to lose, but, but the most important thing is, is making sure that we're ready for next week. You mentioned there about the patterns of play, the combinations. What's it been like coming into a team with Tommy Wright, Scott Rendell, and Adelaide Baggy? Yeah, it's been thoroughly enjoyable. You know, getting used to new players is, is always a task. You know, coming in, you've got so many fresh faces, people that you've never played with before so you do have to take some time to get used to, to how players play you know tendencies etc but as I say we did we did a bit of pattern play this afternoon and I thought things were looking very very positive and I think that it's shown in the games as well you know defensively the, the, the way we moved defensively at Bristol Rovers was excellent you know we had a lot of chances on Saturday um, that all come from those patterns of play and, and getting to know each other as players so yeah I think it's really positive. We've seen you playing in, in all sorts of positions across the, in the final third. Do you have a preference of where that is, or is it all about playing? Um, no, I don't particularly have a preference. Um, you know, if I'm fortunate enough to be playing, then then I'm I'm just trying to get on the ball. Whether that's going in behind, whether that's coming to feet and linking up with with the likes of Billy or, or Runes or Jake or whoever might be in there, Theo. You know, so for me, it is about playing, but at the same time, it's about it's about affecting the game positively uh, from whatever position I'm in. Perfect, and you won't know this, but Totten last season was a tough test for us in pre-season. We expect exactly the same again. Mm. Um, how important do you think that the combinations and, and the play together will be in that game, and, and then working on it going into the new season is just emphasising that? Yeah, massively. The last last pre-season game is always an important one because you are setting yourself up to go into that that first game of the season next week. Um, so the patterns of play have got to be there. You know, we're aware of that as players. The gaffer knows what what he expects out of us. We know what he expects out of us. Um, um, so it is important, not only you know physically doing those patterns of play and, and getting used to them, but but mentally knowing that you've got them, knowing that you've got that connection with another player. For example, you know playing up front with the likes of Tommy, Wally, you know Renz, you know you have to have those connections as players and certainly as strikers to to, to get positive results for the team. Brilliant, James. Thanks very much. No problem.